in this short video tutorial we'll learn how to check whether the caps lock key on your keyboard is turned on or off so if you want to make some logical decisions in your c-sharp code by testing whether the caps lock key is pressed on or if it is pressed off so how will you read that value by using c-sharp so the caps lock key it will either be in the on state or it will be in the off state so we will get the value as true or false so if the caps lock button has been pressed so we will get the value as true if it is not pressed we will get the value as false so let's make use of the boolean type variable so i've created a variable is pressed of the type bool so bool variables actually contains values as either true or false the console class given to us by c sharp has a property called caps lock so this property is a read only property you cannot give it a value you can only read the value of this property and this property tells us whether the the caps lock button on the keyboard whether it is pressed or not whether it is on or off so if we put a breakpoint in our, in our code and we run this code as of now the caps lock button on my keyboard is off so it is not pressed so if you will check the value of is pressed this is it says it's false because the key the caps lock button is not pressed on my keyboard so i'll stop this program now i have pressed the caps lock button on my keyboard let's run this program again and this time you notice that the value of is pressed variable is true so the console dot caps lock uh, property tells us that the the caps lock button on the keyboard has been pressed so if you want to make some logical decisions in your code by checking the value of uh, the value of the caps lock key whether it's pressed or not you can use the console class which has the caps lock property which can give you an indication of whether the caps lock is pressed or not so with this we'll end this short tutorial here for more free c sharp learning content please visit openschool.com/learnc-sharp also please subscribe to our channel to get regular updates on the new videos that we add thank you